Let us look at an example of factor location rating method to decide the facility location. An electronics manufacturer wants to expand by building a second facility. The search has been narrowed to four locations. Assessment of these sites in terms of seven location factors is shown below. The score is based on a rating from 1 to 5 where 1 is poor and 5 is excellent. So as shown in this table, the company has decided on the relevant location factors for their company which are labor climate, quality of life, transportation system, proximity to markets, proximity to materials, taxes and utilities. Next, they have rated each of these factors according to importance and have given each of these a weightage. So labor climate seems to be the most important factor which has a weightage of 20. Quality of life and transportation system have a weightage of 16 each. Proximity to markets has a weightage of 14. Proximity to materials and taxes have a weightage of 12 each. While utilities has a weightage of 10. So the weightage is given such that the total is 100. Now the company has already shortlisted four locations out of which they want to finalize one location for this facility. These four locations are A, B, C and D. They have also rated each of these locations based on the location factors and the score is from 1 to 5 where 1 is poor and 5 is excellent. So for location A, the labor climate is excellent. So they have given a rating of 5. While quality of life is not that good. So it has a rating of 2. For location B, the tax policies are excellent. So it has a rating of 5. Similarly for location C, the tax policies is excellent, so it has a rating of 5 again. For location D, the labor climate is excellent, so it has a rating of 5, while quality of life is poor, so it has a rating of 1. Now we have to calculate the weighted score for each location and suggest which location should be recommended. In the table shown, I have placed the location factors 1 through 7, then the factor weight for each of these factors, and for each of the locations, I have placed the scores given for each of the factors, and we now have to find out the weighted score for each of these locations. So the weighted score for each of the locations will be the product of factor weight and the score for that location. So let's calculate 25 is our 100, 16 twos are 32, 16 threes are 48, 14 fives are 70, 12 twos are 24, 12 twos are 24, and 10 fives are 50. For B, 24 is are 80, 16 threes are 48, 16 fours are 64, 14 threes are 42, 12 threes are 36, 12 fives are 60 and 10 fourths are 40. For location C, the weighted score is 20 fourths are 80, 16 fourths are 64, 
16 threes are 48 14 fours are 56 12 threes are 36 12 fives are 60 and 10 threes are 30 for d 20 fives are 100 16 ones are 16 16 twos are 32 14 fours are 56 12 fours are 48 12 fours are 48 and 10 threes are 30 now let's add up the weighted scores for each of the locations so 4 plus 4 8 plus 8 16 plus 2 18 so 8 and 1 carry over 1 plus 3 4 plus 4 8 plus 7 15 plus 2 17 plus 2 19 plus 5 24 2 plus 1 3 for B, 8 plus 4 is 12, plus 2, 14, plus 6, 20, 2 carry over, 8 plus 2, 10, plus 4, 14, plus 6, 20, plus 4, 24, plus 3, 27, plus 6, 33, plus 4, 37. Similarly for C, 4 plus 8 is 12, plus 6 18 plus 6 24 2 carry over 8 plus 2 10 plus 6 16 plus 4 20 plus 5 25 plus 3 28 plus 6 34 plus 3 37 and for d 6 plus 2 8 plus 6 14 plus 8 22 plus 8 30 3 carry over 3 plus 1 is 4 plus 3 7 plus 5 12 plus 4 16 plus 4 20 plus 3 23 2 carry over 2 plus 1 3 so these are the weighted scores for each of the locations and whichever location has the highest weighted score is the most favorable location so here location C turns out to be the most favorable location while B is also very close in terms of scores so our recommendation would be that the company should open the facility at location C